Sup, though. Inspired by Art. Oh, oh. <coughs> okay, cool. Yeah, he was inspired by RDC World. Real man. Hell, Dave Chappelle, real man. Straight on some real shit? Hell no, nah, I don't like that nigga Freddie, man. And I know a lot of people be asking me, like, yo, why you don't fuck with Freddie? What's up with you and Freddie? Let me tell y'all something. Y'all don't know Freddie like I know Freddie. Crystal <laughs> Lake killer. <laughs> promise you some serious shit and break their fucking promise. I don't fuck with shit like that. So fuck Freddie and his lying ass. Oh, no. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, just the nigga I needed to see. Then why you do that shit, bro? <laughs> you slashed my bitch. I told you she was mine. Man, what bitch? That one bitch over there on Elm Street. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah nigga. Ain't that what I just said? <laughs> well, why would I went over there to chop the bitch up? Bitch got four goddamn cuts down her stomach like she done had four different C-sections. <laughs> <laughs> four different times. Bitch, Michael just got back from his hood yesterday. Oh, Straight no. Stabs, bitches. Leatherface would have made a fucking mess. <laughs> the Jeepers creep asleep. <laughs> nothing about you checking all the bitches that killed Crystal Lake. Man, that's different. You know it. How, Jay? How? Crystal <laughs> Lake folks killed you. Elm Street folks killed me. Yeah, all right, whatever, nigga. Do that shit again, and we gonna have another Freddy versus Jason out this bitch. You better keep calm. I told you, I let you win. Yeah, I slashed this bitch. <laughs>
superstars and shit. Like, I'm popping on YouTube, but it ain't the same. But nobody <laughs> gonna take it if they don't fuck with me or not. But I really don't give a fuck. You feel me? <laughs> gang, gang. <laughs> From DC and Maryland. Yeah. 
Dang, man. <laughs> <laughs> is he stabbing? That's a stab dance. Oh, shit. You turn it up? Oh, shit. <laughs> I was watching this shit like it was a movie, to be honest. If it would have kept going, I wouldn't have been surprised. Mm -hmm. But, um, this shit was mad funny, though. Michael Myers. Michael Myers? Yeah. I think, uh, Michael Myers and Jason might have been the funniest. Yeah. Michael Myers and Jason. They were probably the funniest ones. Freddy was funny, too. But, um... But all right, so when so when Jinx, like the actual Jinx, came in the whole situation, like in the house, the reason I was laughing was because he, uh, how you just gonna go into a house full of killers? He from Chicago. Um, okay. Or that's where his character was from. I got it now. All right. It, it takes. That's where that Jinx was from. I yeah. mean, Jinx is from the Midwest, Gary, Indiana. Yeah. The only reason I know where Jinx is from because uh, it's this one rap. Well, I know where he's from because he told me. Then he rapped it. Yeah. Like, Gary Indiana is where he's from. It's mad close to Chicago. So why not be a Chicago savage in this? Okay. With yeah, a bunch of killers. You know what I mean? Took me a minute to, to yeah, yeah. realize that. Okay. Yeah. yeah. But out of like all of the people, like out of, yeah, all of them, who would you feel most comfortable? I don't know. Most comfortable living with? Yeah. Jinx. <laughs> Probably Jinx. <laughs> okay. I, I, I didn't expect you to say that. Oh, Probably man. Jinx. I'm not staying in there with Michael Myers. I'm not staying in there with Freddy. Not Jason. And not not the ghost face. Oh, man. okay. So one part that I did, I did like was when he was like, um, when J uh, Freddy was with Jason, when they were talking, he was like, I let you win. Oh yeah, that that yeah, that part funny. was funny. Cause, cause I think we, I think Freddie did let him win. I think the gayest part about that movie was they claimed there was gonna be a sequel and they never did it. Like that was a good movie. Yeah. To put to to mash up scary characters, you know what I mean? Have them fight. I swear, like people that do scary movies do not know how to market at all, bro. <laughs> scary movie makers are the worst marketers in the f***ing world, bro. Cause. That's why we barely have any good scary movies now. They all suck at marketing and actually getting some shit that will make people watch it and be like, oh, shit. You it's time for somebody to change the game, man. Yeah, son, it's time for, like, the YouTubers to just take over the whole, all of Hollywood and the industry, period, because more people watch YouTube and all that than... Times have changed. I think we need to take over and make it more interesting because, obviously, these high-paid... Filmmakers do not know what the fuck they doing. They just taking money and running pretty much right now. So why not let the YouTubers and, and creators take over? I think we should just take over that shit because these filmmakers and all that are let's let's, let's do that for they're, like they're a, shitty. They're really shitty. Let's let's do that for like a solid for like a couple years and then let's do like a compare and contrast. Yeah, bro. I mean, like we can just take them all and throw them in a dungeon for a little bit, you know, for a couple of years until we Let decide. The big dogs come in. No yeah, problem. and they need to sit sit their little asses in a dungeon for a little bit, all these shitty films they've been bringing out. What's going on with y'all? You bitch, you. <laughs> <laughs> um, But, nah, this shit was mad funny. I think when Freddy, Freddy's, uh, uh, his, his conversations was mad funny, too. And then, uh... When Jinx came in as the shot right savage, they was like, mm -hmm. Who the fuck is he? You know what I mean? Yeah. So, 
I think it was funny that Shyrak Savage, like, they brought, like, a human in. You know, he brought a human in. And it was just, just to, you know what I mean? Like, yo, we partying and shit? Like, yeah. like nah. But I fucks with it. Jinx, um, my honest opinion, though, Jinx, you did your, you did your thing on this video, especially because it was only you. But the next time you do a video like this, I think you should actually have other people in the match too so y'all can all actually have scenes sitting together and i'm probably i'm pretty sure you already thinking about this shit you know that scorpio shit right we we, we here but it would you already know it would be most definitely better if you had other people in the match so that we could see two two or maybe even three people on the camera you know i mean uh acting out together but this jump was dope as fuck, especially because you did it by yourself. You were the only one in the video, technically. Yeah. So, this shit, bruh. It's time for us to start. Asking all them questions. Asking all them questions. How did you feel about this video? How did you feel? Very entertaining video, and I feel like he did his damn thing in this video. In this whole thing. You Great job. It. You heard it first here. Are you subscribed to Jenks? Are you so subscribed? Have you seen this video before and did you come here for our reaction? Number three is important. What was your favorite part of this video? My favorite part. My my favorite part was the music when they was all going through going through their um their music and shit. Michael Myers, I'm gonna have to say, killed the shit. Yeah, Michael Myers changed the game. <laughs> yeah. For sure. Um, my favorite part was when <clears throat> Freddie and Jason was going back and forth talking. I'm like, yo, I let you win. That's oh, my yeah, favorite yeah. part. But um, if y'all got a favorite part, let us know in the comment section below. Of course, let us know. Let us know. Hashtag sup though. Um, yeah, y'all tell us how y'all felt about the video. Give Jinx some advice if y'all feel like y'all want to give him advice. It's up to Jinx to take it or not. Um, pause. And uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Just let me say it. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Just give me that. Uh, make sure y'all follow us on our uh, Twitter and Instagrams. Those are the ones we probably use the most. Um, oh, make sure y'all go add me or follow me on my SoundCloud too. My SoundCloud is right here. Add me on my SoundCloud. I'm about to drop Cooley Raps 8. I'm on Cooley Raps 8 now. What are you doing? Oh, um. <laughs> so, you know, I'm about to drop Cooley Raps 8. Um, either today or tomorrow, so y'all stay tuned for that. Hit me up on Twitter and Instagram. Hashtag KR8, bro. We out here. Okay. I had to think about that. KR8, cool. No, no, oh, okay. got no, I got it. <laughs> Keep it cool. Keep it classy. We love you. Stay awesome. Always. And forever. Flop, 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 flop. Peep, peep. <laughs>